nigga. Yes, sir. We are back, y'all. We are back with another freaking video. Video. Man, this time up, man, we got freaking Ron White dicking around <laughs> with Tiger Woods. Okay, and I've never heard of this guy. I've seen a little snippet. He came up. Um, I saw him on in the past. I didn't see this scene, but okay. I've seen one of his. It, he had that black on, but so Let's it's, do it. it's new to me. Let's see who this is. My favorite thing about playing Vegas is I get to play this golf course called Shadow Creek, which is one of the most exclusive golf courses in the world. I worked for them three years, didn't even know it existed because they knew if I found out it existed, that I'd, I'd pester the fuck out of them until they put it in my contract, which is exactly what happened. <laughs> amazing this golf course is just fucking so tricked out the first time i walked through the gates i was like nobody's stopping me <laughs> <laughs> it's where all the pros play when they're in vegas and i was out there this summer and tiger woods was out there just dicking around <laughs> and look and he and let me come to that but he so he got that that straight texas son out just tiger woods out there dicking around <laughs> Dicking around, you messed up. That's wrong too. And I may sign my golf glove. I got to meet the most famous person I've ever met, and I know a lot of famous people, but nobody as famous as Tiger fucking Woods. I love Tiger, man. I defended Tiger when all that stuff first came out. When I heard those initial rumors, I felt sick to my goddamn stomach for the guy because I've never been accused of doing anything I didn't do. <laughs> not one goddamn time. I did it every single time. <laughs> Damn. Not once could I go, no, that was Glenn Campbell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, a lot of things smell like strippers. Oh my goodness. <laughs> like what? Like what? And I defended him to my wife. I said, you don't know what this guy's been through. He had his first famous golf shot on television when he was two years old. You don't know what his home life's like. You can't judge the guy because he made one mistake. Right. right. And he just got number 13, 14, 15, 16. <laughs> I started going, God damn, Tiger. Come on, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> and it got to the point where every time he got caught with another woman, my wife would go like this. <laughs> what? I don't even know the fucking guy. That's your boy, though. I was him, holding yeah. his dick the whole time. We watched him make that long apology on television, and afterwards, my wife goes, well, do you think a guy like Tiger could quit cheating on his wife? And I said, <laughs> That's wrong. I know. That's wrong. You bet. <laughs> Which you know is bullshit, because you know as well as I do, if a guy likes strange, getting him to quit wanting strange is like getting a dog who likes to kill chickens to quit killing chickens. They don't even know what you're talking about. Right. <laughs> Facts. You gotta quit killing chickens. All right, let me see if I got this straight. <laughs> <laughs> I can still kill chickens. Right. Ooh, yes. <laughs> no, you can't kill chickens anymore. All right. Let's say I'm in a hotel room with the chicken. Let's say the chicken just wants to touch me. <laughs> Can I kill that chicken? <laughs> no? Mm -mm. My wife told me all women want the same thing. They want to marry somebody who will never have sex with anybody else, no matter what. And I said, well, then maybe you should consider marrying somebody that nobody else wants to fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong. much to you. <laughs> Wrong Don't marry the answer. most famous golfer in the world. Marry the most famous frisbee golfer in the world. <laughs> Ain't no line to fuck that dude. Frisbee golfer? Never heard of it. Is I that real? I don't think so. How you gonna be a frisbee golfer? What I think of golfer. Yeah, golfer. How you gonna be a frisbee I, golfer? What I think about when he's saying frisbee golfer is that 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 dude playing hacky sack with that that poncho and that hair and that little, little stanking. Mm. <laughs> don't get it, don't get, don't get it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <clears throat>
We had a chat about cheating that day, man. I bet. I bet. So I told him, she goes, listen, Ron, let's get this straight. Sex is sex, period. I said, no, now, wait a minute. Oral sex is not the same as intercourse. She goes, it's the exact same thing. I said, it's not the same price. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh -oh. uh, <laughs> I heard that on the radio. Knock him out. Cheat much? Okay. It all comes down to opportunity, man. Some guys are put into a position where they have to, have to say no to beautiful women, and that is hard to do. And some guys are never put in that position, and that's way fucking easier. <laughs> I see these big 350 pound guys all the time going I have never cheated on my wife I'm like I bet that was tough <laughs> Tiger doesn't get any credit for all that pussy you turned down and that's the number you're looking for right there <laughs> my wife's best friend her husband cheated on her and my wife hates Tiger's guts and I'm like well what about that guy you don't hate that guy she goes he did it one time I said he had one chance <laughs> sex with a hundred percent of the women he possibly could his entire goddamn life. Tiger was 18 for 82,000. That takes a little goddamn discipline right there. Okay. If 82,000 women want to have sex with you and you only fuck 18 of them, that's love. <laughs> nah. He was in love with that woman. Oh my God. She broke his tiny tiger heart. Tiny Tiger Heart. <laughs> 18 out of 18, uh, 82,000. That's love. <laughs> he lost all those sponsors, which never made sense to me because his core fan base is men. I don't know one guy in America gave a fiddler's fuck what he did. <laughs> I guarantee you, not one guy in America went, Really? Tiger got some strange pussy? <laughs> I'm dropping ATT! <laughs> <laughs> Not one guy gave me fiddler's fuck. <laughs> <laughs> now, when they were around their wives, they'd act like they gave a fiddler's fuck, get all foghorn, leghorn. Why, I never, I can't believe a man would commit <laughs> such transgressions towards his wife. God, leave, boy. They sound like one of them dudes uh, back, in the, back in the country when you were drinking shine. <laughs> I say, I say, how's his relationship with the Lord, I'd like to know. The Lord. <laughs> Sound like a minister. Oh, Back in around their the old well, church. I wonder what kind of cologne he wears. <laughs> <laughs> I want to smell just like that dude, man. <laughs> you want to, be a, want to get the same. He lost so many sponsors, I'm thinking about bringing him over to Ron White, Inc., and not because we need a new face for the company. I'd just love to have somebody around the house to fade the heat when I fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Dirty. Ron White, you are the most selfish prick I have ever met in my life. Tiger, get in here. <laughs> Dang. You tell her what you did. <laughs> selfish. Dang. Selfish. Ron White, you are the finest man I have ever known. <laughs> That's I what it'll go to. I bend your knee and suckle your penis. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, baby. <laughs> Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. Watch out for those ears. <laughs> no, let's go for no. My next guess is the first. No, no. No. Mm -mm. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, Tiger did get a little heat, but, you know, oh, I mean, was it just guys that were really, I mean, you really didn't, I mean, was it just women that were really kind of saying stuff? I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I, I was know. sad for him. I'm, I'm, I really was, you know. I think Poor Tiger. People, I think, I don't know. I would just say, if I could just assume this. That it was probably made from the majority of women that were on the on the top board with the sponsorship. Probably like, oh hell no! It's usually the guys. I were like, you know, do we need to cut them because of that? I mean, he was wrong, no doubt. I mean, you know, but is that worth vows, is that worth cutting vows. your sponsor? I know. I mean, but you know, it's the image. You know, 
Is that worth cutting the sponsor though? I never understood that. I mean, it just it goes that's his against. that's his household. That's nothing to do. Right. Now he start playing golf like crap, and then you cut him. But but, but that that yeah, that's based off of you know your belief, your faith based belief in what God, how He honors you know marriage. That's not something that you know he you think condones. He's, you think these conscious a lot of these these no. But I'm saying what I'm saying is that that had nothing to do. That's his marriage vows. That has nothing to do with. The sponsorship, in my opinion, because okay. that's separate. That's business. That's business. All right, man. This that's okay. the end of this one, man. We got we got <laughs> Ron White technical. dicking around with Tiger Woods, man. Hey, man, if you like that it one, was man, pretty good. smash the like button. It give was pretty us, good. Leave us a comment and yeah, subscribe and leave comments for more videos because, like I said, we look through them and we and we do them if they if we choose to pick that particular the one. Nobody with deep talk. Yep. <laughs> So, man, peace out, man. See you on the next yeah. video. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ding. What like is that. that? That's how I'm going to exit. <laughs> and then it just, it just go right to our outro. Fellow Ninja Turtles. Now, I remember Bewitch used to do that. Harry the big old mansion on the lake of Lambo and my carriage. They say I want to be the only one. No baby mama drama. No could it, but it's out of peace.